everyone how are you i hope you all are fine so in this video we will discuss about chemistry okay so in last video i have discussed about uh, uh, atoms and molecule okay and in this video we will discuss about the the dalton atomic theory okay so let us discuss uh, all the one by one all the points the theory that is given by dalton okay so our first uh, point is all matters is made up of very tiny particles called atoms okay it means uh, all the matters is made up of very tiny particles called atom okay so which participate in chemical reaction it means uh, the atom that is participating which uh, which participates in sorry which participates in chemical reaction okay and second one is atoms are individual particles which cannot be created okay atoms are individual particles it cannot be created okay and are destroyed in a chemical reaction okay it is not be created and not be destroyed in a and also destroyed in a chemical reaction okay cannot be destroyed and created okay next one is atom of a given element are identical it means atom of a given element is uh, are identical in mass and chemical property it means uh, the given element have identical sorry are identical uh, uh, the given element have identical mass and also identical chemical properties okay i hope you understand all three points that is uh, given by the dalton and our next three points are atoms of a different element have different masses and chemical properties it means the different different elements have different different mass and different different their chemical properties okay this is obviously a uh, similar uh, simple that is uh, if the element is different have a different their different mass and different chemical properties okay all the elements have different masses and different chemical properties atoms combine in a ratio of a small whole number to form compound it means to formation of compound atoms are combined into a small sorry into a small whole number to form compound okay and last one is the relative number of and kinds of atoms are constant in a given compound compound it means in compound the kinds of atom are constant it means uh, they cannot vary okay the relative number and the kinds of atom okay they are constant these are the six points of dalton atomic theory that you have to learn okay that our first point is atoms is made up of very tiny particle and also participate in chemical reaction okay and atoms are indivisible particle which cannot be created and or destroyed okay in the chemical reaction and now we will discuss about iron the charge species are known as ions okay and we can also write and we can also write electrically charged atom or a group of atom are are called 
charged species are known as ion and the electrically charged atom or a group of atom are known as ion okay so ions are the charged species okay and also we can say electrically charged atom or a group of atom either it is positively or negatively it means either it is positive or negative are called ion okay so ions are uh, ions now types of ions okay there are two types of ion first one is cation and second one is anion okay there are two types of uh, 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 sorry ions a uh, first one is cations and second one is anion okay cation is also called uh, positively positively charged and okay so cation is also called positively charged and anion is also called negatively charged it means the uh, the element which which have the positive charge called cation and the sorry the atom which have the positively charged called cation and with and the uh, negative charge called anion like uh, positively charged like uh, for example you can write na plus ca plus plus okay and here for example cl minus and triple minus okay these are the these are the example of cation and anion okay these are the example of cation and anion that is positively charged is called sodium and calcium and anion it means negatively charged example chlorine and nitrogen okay so this is all about ions and its type and now atoms in the types of uh, sorry atoms in the types in uh, and now what is poly atomic ion okay what is poly atomic ion so so a group of atom carrying a charge a group of atom it means uh, here the group of atom carrying a charge is known as polyatomic ion for example if we uh, talk about means h hc co3 and phosphate that is PO, PO4 carrying a charge, okay. 
So this is a group of atom carrying a charge called polyatomic ion. Okay. So if you see here carbonate and phosphate are polyatomic because here the group of atom here is hydrogen car uh, carbon and also oxygen are available and here phosphorus and oxygen and this one is phosphate and this one is carbonate okay so these are uh, these are called polyatomic ion and now and now we will discuss about laws of combination sorry 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 here is laws of chemical combinations okay so when we talk about laws of chemical combination it means atoms Combine to together to form molecule molecule compound under. certain laws called laws of chemical combination okay so here so here we so here we are uh, Written that the atoms of a atoms combine together to form molecule. Okay, atoms are combined to form molecule compound and under certain laws. It means when we the molecule are combining together to form uh, sorry when we when the atoms are combining together to form molecule there are they combine together under certain laws okay called laws of chemical combi combination okay there are two laws of chemical combination that is uh, laws of chem that is laws of uh, constant proportion and laws of conservation of mass okay so there are two laws are involved in this that is uh, uh, laws of constant proportion and laws of conservation of mass okay so in this video we will discuss about about the Dalton atomic theory and ions and also the laws of chemical combination okay and that and their type and their laws are and their laws we discussed in the next video so that's all for today thank you have a nice day